Good Day Collective. This is a healing and ascension message for the collective that has Libra in their birth chart. You can be a Queen of Cups or a King of Cups or a Knight of Cups. This archetype message is for that collective, okay? Remember to only take what resonates, leave what does not. The archetype message for Libra. The box is sneaky, insidious, and everywhere, limiting us at the most unconscious levels. It is built of layer upon layer of social constructs and pressures. Some of you all have expectations from the people you've grown up with, whether they are teachers, classmates, relatives, neighbors, friends of friends. Nothing toxic, okay? Let's see what's going on with the female Libras dealing with this box energy. universe what is the collective those dealing with the box in the box has their energy in the box for somebody your energy is in this person's box because they stole it from you whoever stole it from you now um, is getting communication messages of concern involving bad health. More communication. Fourteen thirty one and seven. What does the collective need to know about this message of concern? Page of Swords. That could represent a person. It could be a younger Libra. What about the Page of Swords? What about the Page of Swords? This page of swords wants to communicate, but the hermit is in reverse. They're stuck in some magic. This Libra used magician in reverse. A young Libra and an older Libra. High Priestess in reverse and the Sun card in reverse. Oh, this Libra energy is beyond karmic. Karmic is an understatement for this Libra energy. Whoever has gotten in her box though, they're in the Nine of Pentacles in reverse, bad health, ace of cups, the relationship was built on a uh, faulty, greedy foundation, unhealthy foundation, most importantly, 
so it has crumbled and it ends with the nine of swords dark night of the soul gossip paranoia anxiety complete embarrassment this person feels like they're being tortured but that's what they called on in this five of wands energy this libra was um, in the reverse pretty much They should have been more careful of the energy that they stole and put in that box. That was the lesson. That was the lesson for Libra. So let's go ahead and move forward to the Aquarius. Aquarius, the bridge. Aquarius energy. Aquarius Collective finally understands and believes they are the bridge of heaven to earth. But for some, it's the end of the bridge. So, Aquarius Collective. Bridges are built to connect two worlds. They create flow, allowing us to travel between realms, ideologies, personalities. This archetype is the gesture of acceptance, of saying yes rather than withdrawing, separating, and saying no. Healing and communication are made possible when we enter a state of curiosity, wonder, and learning. Study the connections between the disconnected parts of our life. And remember that a bridge can't be forced. It must be made with love, okay? Aquarius Collective, B building bridges. Building bridges. What does the collective need to know about this Aquarius energy? Someone is 38 years old. What does the Aquarius energy need to know about the bridge? The ever ending, there's a new beginning. The universe said they go to bridge. What else is there? You, what else are you thinking about? That's leaving thieves in despair. It's been changes in spiritual courtrooms. Amongst communities. A community is wanting to put an ending to uh, conflict, toxic behaviors. A community of people want to put an ending to these type of behaviors out of the energy of gossip, slander, scandals, things involving children, spell work, twin flames, the way people go, how contracts and things are made. Aquarius. 
Low vibrational Aquarius are in spiritual jail and low vibrational Libras, especially the ones that work together off of that nine of pentacles in reverse energy, greed, privileged lady in reverse type of energy. No matter if they men or women. Look, the five of wands right here. This arguments now. This arguments now. Ten of Swords. It's been a long time coming. The group of people made a decision. What is what is the Aquarius collective need to know about you, baby? Okay. They're upset. They are unhappy. They feel unpleasant. Wishes were not met. Because Ace of Wands flew on the, on the death card. Their wishes were not met. They're overwhelmed, stressed, and burdened. Ace of Wands, Aquarius. Yeah, Knight of Swords, that's you. It's judgment for the choices made. Choices made, especially while dealing with the Libra in a relationship, marriage, or living situation. Yeah, nine of wands in reverse though. It's no blame game. Everybody, set the world card, everybody was aware of who the group of money hungry people were. Stalking gang stalkers, using magic. Who, who, were, who was doing it? Who was it impacting? That's already been revealed. Aquarius Collective with the thoughts. Aquarius Collective with the thoughts. When it comes to that relationship or you were thinking about uh, that marriage or that uh, situation that occurred. While you're thinking about a situation that just overall hurts. Oh. It's the Eight of Wands in reverse. It's a return to sender reversal. So somebody's thinking. Somebody is experiencing a reversal. Ace of Swords. And they're feeling heartbroken by it. They already know intuitively this person has already put the situation to rest. It's healing, making better choices, and moving forward in a stable um truthful manner moving forward being more responsible while going through judgment somebody doesn't want to be responsible page of swords six of cups nice you know, regret for being hot-headed now somebody regrets being hot-headed. Libra and Aquarius. Whatever thoughts y'all are having now, just know it's the tower, okay? Gemini, the gem, the gem. Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. There is, there is 
there is a song recommended for you to listen to called Diamonds in the Mine, M-I-N-E, by Leonard Cohen. Now I'm just assuming it's a song. The Gemini always stands in contrast to its surroundings. You can't find it when you're among comforts and pleasantries. Precious stones develop slowly deep in the earth amid pressure and darkness. Gemini Collective, envy, greed, and grasping. That's the type of magic, black magic, that's been being put out through music towards um, us young, naturally talented people for at least the last 40 years, knowing me. Although we are irreplaceable, generative, shining, and unique, Gemini has been being misused as basically Lenas X said it in that song, he want the ones that envy. Yeah, that's a no-go. Greed and grasping. Mm. Well, Gemini, it's time for the collective to be led towards our true self, our purpose, and our destiny. Gemini. Whether you're a male or a female, unexpected income in reverse, lovers in reverse, and privileged lady. So for some of y'all, y'all learned that, okay, money is not the object of everything. That's not it. I walk away from that. I learned that while under judgment. Some Geminis are having to walk away from the courtroom knowing that they're under judgment because they interfered. Whether it was twin flame related or not, it's still judgment uh, related. Privileged lady, privileged lady for Gemini Collective. Older Libra and Aquarius females that's no longer in two minds about being insecure, the things that they've done out of insecurity repetitively over and over during the Knight of Wands. It's now going to be confrontation amongst Knight of Wands and the Knight of Swords. You're not going to find that, like, I've said it, so take it for what it is. Knight of Wands and Knight of Swords collected. It's in the Three of Swords. Okay, so low vibrational Gemini, low vibrational Libra, low vibrational Aquarius. You have to practice self-love and self-care. It don't matter how low you feeling. I'm glad you know that's that's being able to do that is a gift within itself. Y'all have taken advantage of the community that has been taking care of you all over and over. They don't feel happy about it. Yeah, they're ready for y'all to go ahead and serve y'all karma so they can heal. The King of Cups Collective, that's how he feels. That's how they feel. Mm -hmm. See, that's how the ancestors feel. Ten of Pentacles and the Page of Wands. It 
It's masculine energy. It's like holding on for their life at this point. They don't know what to do. These are not divine masculines. These are just king of cups energies, fathers, emotionally mature and or sensitive men. Just, yeah. They know the truth is they have to go heal. Some of them have to go into the hospital, that imprisonment energy or prison. That's bringing balance though and restoration. Oh, King of Swords then came out. Oh, the Nine of Pentacles. The King of Swords are isolating um, children at this time. They're, they're doing something to make sure children aren't um, sacrificed basically hangman in reverse and then you got the queen of swords in the three of cups though everybody is out here Somebody's trying to put a rip in my third eye. I knew that's the karmic masculine. His baby mama don't like me, literally. But that's because she heard some lies about me. Somebody's child's mother heard some lies involving a king of swords, involving an Aquarius and a Libra. So she felt like let her hold on to her karmic masculine even tighter for no reason. I mean, to each his own, I'm not holding on to nobody. <laughs> so now, yeah, the King of Wands principality, y'all in regret and uninspired every time there's communication of y'all not moving forward, even though y'all have already gotten that enlightenment. It's just time now. Y'all not feeling confident because y'all know when it's up, it's stuck. Oh, well, it's called consequences, literally. Okay, so that was your archetype reading. Don't, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Okay, I don't do personal readings for people that, um, God doesn't tell me to do it for. I've never had to turn down a reading, but trust me, if you try to get a reading from me with negative intentions, that's that's all. <laughs> that's all, all whoever decides to take that route, okay? I know my intentions, my ancestors know my intentions. So yeah, that was the archetype reading for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius Collective. Make sure you guys pay attention to nature around you, okay? Talk to you guys later.